Hello friends, I hope you are doing well. Uh, in this video, we will be discussing about uh, interview preparation and the tips for uh, preparing the interview. Uh, how to study, what to study, what are the things that we need to focus on the uh, in the preparation part. And how to crack the interviews easily. So before going to the actual uh, content, if you are watching my channel for the very first time, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell icon. So whenever I uploaded a video, you will get a notification on your uh, smartphone. And here, friends, I have uh, developed a new website with the help of my friend. And you can go through this website, datastagetraining.com. So here you can see my phone number and email ID. And if you're looking for training, you can uh, post your consult, your name, your email ID, and which country you're from with a WhatsApp number and followed by your message that you can uh, send a notification to me so that I will receive an email. So these are the services that I am offering, self-learning uh, program, self-learning videos, and group coaching and one to one coaching and uh, so here i'll be providing data stage training and ibm information based training and job support and about me you know me all uh, i have uh, having i have more than 13 plus years experience in it and primarily worked on data stage information analyzer pentaho data integrator and 2019 onwards i'm working as a part-time trainer and on job support consultant for India and uh, UK, US and UK across the globe, students from across the globe. So here you can see, guys. So the fundamentals, data everything fundamentals, data stage syllabus, the content details. You can go through this website and please comment me how this website looks like. And here uh, I have a Facebook page and LinkedIn, not LinkedIn, the YouTube. So you, you know all my YouTube channel, right? So just this my Facebook page. So here I'll be posting some videos. Okay, so any live classes going on. So you can watch it in uh, the live classes. Okay, so daily live classes, 70% uh, I'll be going through a live platform. So you can follow me either in YouTube or in uh, Facebook. Okay, so you have to keep uh, watching. Uh, this content, whatever I'm posting here. So you can see the live classes. And the, this is a demonstration which has happened on June. And these are two live classes. Okay. And if you're coming to my YouTube channel, like uh, let's see, YouTube, click on here in YouTube. So it will redirect to the videos. So here you can see the live classes. What's our regular live classes? You can see the regular live classes. So if you want to go through these videos, you can go through these videos, friends. Thank you. So how to prepare interviews? So this is uh, the easy way we can crack interviews like by prepare well, how to prepare well. So focus on ETL concepts. Okay. So ETL, why we use ETL? What is the purpose of using ETL tools and data averaging concepts like data mods, different kinds of dimension table, fact tables. So loading mechanism, data loading mechanisms, initial load, delta load, and ETL process, data acquisition, extraction, transformation, and loading, code-based ETL tool, geo-based ETL tools, OLAP, OLAP function, okay, and OLTP, differences between OL, OLTP system to the OLAP system. So we have to be focused on the ETL concept. So if you want to watch uh, data origin concepts, so here you can see in my videos, Go to videos here. You can see the data version concepts videos. Okay, so here you have to search. So there are a lot many videos, friends. So you have to search here regarding data version concepts. And there, there are, there'll be two sessions. One is part one and part two. You can uh, refer those. So that that covers entire uh, data version videos. Okay, and the next one is focus on data stage. So here you can see. I uh, have covered uh, 40 to 50 percent of the content in the video format and remaining 50 percent you have to enroll for my training program so here trainings will happen on every monthly basis so every month one month uh, the training will be completed so currently uh, we are in june month right i mean Ju july we're starting of july and currently june month training is uh, 
going to complete on 9th by coming Sunday. And new batch will start, I have taken a gap of one day and the new batch starts on 11th. Actually. So you have to follow, uh, keep to my YouTube channel. So here you can see the playlist, like uh, you can see good data stage demo. So, uh, so here you can see the list of videos. So you can see from demo sessions happening from April 2022 onwards. You can see the latest video. So here you can see new batch will be starts on 11th July. Like that, you have to uh, go through the play playlist and upcoming training program that you can enroll here. Okay, so you can uh, reach out to me. So for the uh, training details, uh, the fee and all the many things. So in data stage, what to be need to be focused mainly on the stages, file stages. Okay, so you can take a note, uh, friends. Okay, so what to study? So focus on file stages. File stages. So in this file stages are uh, sequential file, file set, file set data set. And external source stage, external source stage, uh, external target stage. Okay, and stage STG given STG with stage. Okay, and complex plot file, complex uh, plot file for uh, well, for maintenance file data. Okay, plot file. And they are uh, cloud related files. Okay, so these are store the data internal for the cloud environments. Okay, these stages you have to be focused when to use these stages, what are the files that it supports, what is the difference between these stages. You have to master it, friends. Okay, so and the next thing is processing stages. Processing stages uh, mainly. Processing, data processing stages. Processing stages here, you have to focus on number one, transformer stage. So you have to be familiar with all the options in the transformer stage. And the next one is aggregator. I'm writing in a short form, aggregator stage. AGG means aggregator. And the next one is uh, Sort both one is remove duplicates. Okay, so what are the methods that you can remove duplicates? And the fifth one is um, fifth one funnel, and the sixth one is join, seventh one is lookup. When we use lookup, when we use join, when we use the match stage, you should be familiar with all these concepts and. What are the differences? So here you can see <clears throat> match stage, match stage STD, okay. And you can go for this uh, pivot, pivot enterprise, pivot here, enterprise. And 10th one, you can focus on change data capture, CDC. CDC, change data capture, change apply. So change apply is used for implement SCD. Type one, change apply. Okay. And the next one is uh, compare. We rarely use these stages, but should have our knowledge. Different stage. Okay. And uh, column exports and import. Column export and import okay so this is important to generate uh, header and footer for a whenever uh, output is a file import okay Re restructuring data restructuring data and you can uh, go through this uh, data quality stage quality stage like uh, hierarchical and uh, XML, how to deal with XML files, how to deal with uh, data quality rules. Okay, and uh, how to work call web services and how to connect to how to environment. How to, 
okay and coming to databases so databases will be covering with rdbms so rdbms means ms means like you can say teradata db2 okay db2 oracle and uh, ms other ms sql server with odbc connectors ODB, okay and other databases and other rdbms databases and and other cloud uh, databases cloud db okay so here you can see aws azure gcp bigquery This is a big query and snowflake. Okay. So the, these stages you have to master and when to use uh, on which scenario, when a problem occurs, when to use this particular stage. Based on the scenario, you have to be familiar with all these stages. And yeah, so this is about uh, data stage. And you have to focus on scenarios, real-time scenarios real-time uh, interview scenarios. Okay. So scenarios you can watch in my YouTube channel. And uh, if you're looking for real-time interview scenarios, I'll give you some the discounted price. So please text me in my WhatsApp number. So I have 31 interview scenarios. So I'll be keeping uh, doing videos on interview scenarios. So a few videos are uh, publicly watched and few videos are uh, paid membership so we had to for the membership and all you can uh, reach out to me so that i'll give you the discounted price okay and real time scenarios are important then the next one we need to focus here is uh sql okay so sql uh, especially we need to focus on constant joins okay so sql what need to be focus SQL main joins, okay, subqueries, subqueries, constraint, constraints, and collab functions. And here, functions and string functions. data filters data filter concepts and date functions date functions and cast functions converting one data type to another data type so this from cast function okay so this we have to be master in uh, in sql and one more thing indexes this is very very important indexes you have to be master about the indexes okay right so coming to the unix so unix the next thing is unix unix is uh, the basic unix command and the scripting okay so here you can see few resources that are related to unix tutorial.com unix tutorial .org. so here you can refer this uh, uh, tutorials here we have basic unix commands you can uh, go through this uh, website Okay, so what are the commands and file transfer? You can go through this, uh, the basic Unix commands. Okay, and if you need related videos, you can go through here, go through here. Okay, so Unix commands. Okay, and primarily thing is like uh, before starting up the technical interview, they will ask about your uh, project. So what and all you kept in your resume. So you have to be confident and you should be able to express uh, the project in a simplified manner. And uh, so that uh, you have to be clear in your uh, communication, what you want to say. And if any question arrives, how to respond to that question. Uh, 
not to go in a controversy way, you should have to uh, answer in a such a way that so that the interviewer cannot question you back again on that uh, uh, on the same question. Or you can deviate the, sometimes you can uh, deviate the topic. So if you are unable to answer a few questions, sometimes I used to deviate the interviewer. Okay, so that, 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 that chance also is possible. Sometimes if they are not in that much uh, focus on it, and he will ask uh, uh, the questions on the deviated topic. Okay, so first, uh, the, till the introduction project uh, explanation, there itself you will get uh, some clear uh, picture. And then they will go for technical discussion on data stage and scenarios. Once they are happy with the scenarios, what you addressed, and 90 or 95, 99% you are selected. And if they are asked you questions, SQL, if you are unable to answer one of them, that's okay. They will consider your uh, profile. Okay. So recently I have uh, came across uh, IBM interview, even I have attended. So the interviews happen only just 10 minutes. Okay, so directly the interviewer after uh, telling my project and what are the projects that I worked, uh, worked for, I have explained him in uh, 24 minutes. 50 minutes onwards, he started about asking about scenarios. He asked four scenarios. For each scenario, I have given three solutions. Then, then he did not uh, dig further and your technical interview is done. We'll have next round interview with your my reporting manager. That's it. So interview has been closed within 10 minutes. So you have to be master all these uh, interview scenarios. Okay, so if you're looking for interview scenarios, you can uh, text me in a WhatsApp number. Okay. Yeah, so that's it, friend. Okay, so if you're looking for any help to crack the interviews, and if you need any study material, please text me so that I can help you and I will share the documents. Thank you. Thanks for watching this video. Have a great day. Bye.